beautiful people welcome back to my channel my name is Nissy T um, now this is a bit of a random video I know that I'm due um, to make the next video which is going to be the question and answer session um, in terms of Cambridge what it's like living in Cambridge and all the weird and wacky questions that you have but um, I just wanted to make this quick quick video because I woke up in a bit of a a bit of a funny place today like I even tweeted today like I wanted to listen to Afrobeats and listen to gospel and listen to old school R&B all at the same time and I woke up in a mood where I felt so loving and so happy but then at the same time I wanted to like beat someone up which is really bad um I'm not gonna go and beat someone up but yeah I've woken up in a funny mood and again I just want to apologize for the lighting I know the lighting is really really crap in here um but yeah it's something that I'm gonna work on and it's something that hopefully will get better um but the reason why I'm making this video is because on Twitter okay all the time you see people saying do you know what I've got this idea I've got this I'm gonna do this I'm gonna do that I'm gonna do this but then they wait for tomorrow to do it or some people that will say the most annoying thing, I'm going to do it tomorrow. Do not be stupid because tomorrow may never come. That is why I'm making this video right now. It's going to be very short, it's going to be very quick, but it's just for me to kind of tell you and talk to you about my frustration, okay? You need to understand that life is so unpredictable. Things happen every single day that we never expect, you know? We never expected it. Things just happen out of the blue. People live today, tomorrow, blink of an eye, click of a finger, they're gone. Someone that you could have been speaking to every single day of your life, someone that you could have loved, someone that you could have been so passionate about, tomorrow they've disappeared, they're blank out of your life, you're burying them, they're in a coffin. Now, I never used to appreciate this before, but it was only until my best friend passed away that I realised that someone that you could love so dearly and someone that you could think is going to be there till whenever, till you're married, till you're whatever, could literally just blink of an eye, gone. What I'm trying to say is that whatever plans you have whatever you want to do start today do not wait for tomorrow because tomorrow might never come now i know this might sound like i'm being really 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 um harsh and you might be thinking like okay you're coming a bit aggressive a bit whatever but i think people need to understand this and people need to know that your dreams your ambitions you need to go for go for it from today from now you need to get up whatever you want to do whatever you see yourself doing don't start tomorrow don't say i'm going to do it tomorrow don't be i'm going to do it tomorrow type of fool don't be that person because to, you might go to sleep today and god forbid but you might not see tomorrow you might go to sleep today and god forbid but you might fall into a coma you don't know what could happen and then what what legacy are you leaving behind what um what are you leaving behind of yourself what can people turn around and say about you now one thing that I'm saying is don't be stupid and go and be like, okay, right, I'm going to pack my bag, we're going to live in a village and just take your kids and your family and go and live in a village. Obviously, I'm not saying be stupid. I'm not saying go and um, quit your job because at the end of the day, you know, life is hard. People have bills to pay. People have mortgages to pay. You know, you have wife, you have, a, you have your kids, etc. I'm not saying be stupid. Be wise about your decisions, but also know that tomorrow might never come. So that holiday that you've been planning for for such a long time and have been wanting to go to for such a long time don't wait until next year or whenever to do it because like i said you might not see next year being alive right now is such a blessing but you need to learn from that you need to understand that at the end of the day do you know what let me take on this holiday let me go let me do my thing do you know what babe let's just turn around and be like do you know what babe we've been planning this holiday for a long time we've been putting it up for a long time let's just book it let's book it let's get some money together let's get some money together and let us just go because literally people that you love and you hold so dear you need to appreciate them every single day of your life don't wait until valentine's day don't wait until mother's day father's day or anything like that because you could literally walk out of your door and get hit by a truck they your family member god forbid but could walk out the door and get stabbed or get shot on the street and die and will you turn around and say do you know what i loved them passionately i love them with all my heart and i show them that i love them or are you going to turn around and regret that you never even 
had the chance to kind of fulfill all the desires and all the dreams and everything that you wish for and boy like it literally was until my best friend passed away that I realized that hmm hmm I never thought I'd be getting emotional like this yeah you see crack on YouTube never yeah um I never thought I'd get emotional like that but it is that deep and it frustrates me and it angers me when I go on Twitter or I go on Facebook or whatever social media and there's so many people out there that are so talented that have dreams that have aspirations but they say they use excuses like oh I'm too young or oh I'm too this or I'm too that or I'm too. listen you need to understand that life is too short if you want something you need to go out and get it right now whatever it may be it might even be you know a dream and ambition in terms of like a job or anything like that it might just be you want to lose weight listen if you want to lose weight get up right now there's people out there making youtube videos and um one thing that i'm going to do is i'm going to leave links below um to like some of the people that i've been watching like um lola i think it's lola wait let me find it on here lola something i forgot her name i watch her youtube videos all the time and I can't believe I've forgotten her name, but she makes incredible YouTube videos. Like, she is such an inspiration. She was, you know, big before, but she worked super, super, super hard for her to um, lose a lot of weight. And over five years, yeah, it might seem like a very long time, but over five years, she did it. She, and now she looks absolutely amazing. So... And one thing that I watched in her video as well was she was saying how, um, you know, it doesn't matter if today you were eating a bar of chocolate. If you want to start your diet, you start it now. Not even a diet, sorry, she doesn't like the word diet. She likes the word lifestyle. Change that lifestyle. Otherwise, you'll sit there, you'll be far forever, my friend. You're good. Like, that's, that's the truth. If you don't get up and you motivate yourself and you push yourself and you push and you push and you push, no one can do that for you. So if you want to start a diet, start a diet now if you want to um start up a business idea get on with it start planning start prepping start thinking of the people you're going to go and pitch to do it now because tomorrow you might not be here tomorrow i might not be here and i pray that i can make some sort of difference every single day of my life if you wanted to start a youtube channel start it now who are you waiting for what are you waiting for to buy a million dollar camera no start it now start somewhere and start making your progression and moving forward is something that i'm deeply passionate about and something that literally i woke up this morning and i was just so moved by it and no i can't find her right now like she ain't even gonna know that i'm tagging her in this but literally i'll post her the link to her youtube channel below so if you're looking to lose weight there'll be a link below i've also done a little bit of research as well into like um places where you can go and pitch ideas or like um how to start up a business just things that i went on google it might not help you but if you think it does if you think it will or help someone else there's going to be links below as well literally just push yourself work hard and progress literally life is too short tomorrow you might not come to see it you might not live you might not be breathing tomorrow so what are you going to do today that's going to make a change that's going to make a difference and that's going to show who you are and um one more thing before i go as well is one thing that really hurts me or that frustrates me is people that can't see their value or people that just like live life like I don't have a purpose, I don't have a meaning, I'm worthless, I'm this, I'm that. You need to take all of those thoughts out of your mind and you need to cast them away, rebuke them from your life. You need to understand that every single person has a purpose, a purpose to fulfill on this planet. You might still need to find that purpose, but work on finding that purpose. But you need to understand that you are not an accident. You didn't just kind of poof out of nowhere and happen. You are here for a reason. Find that reason and develop it and fulfill that purpose. That's all I can say. Just fulfill your purpose on this planet and make a change and make a difference. Um, but yeah, so that's just a little thing that I just wanted to talk to you guys about. I know it's a bit random, but it's just something that I just woke up really like, I have to talk to you guys about this. I have to talk to you guys about this. I just had to like, but yeah, um, keep an eye out as well. Obviously, my next vlog is going to be the question and answer session, the Cambridge question and answer session. So I put it out on all my social media, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, everything. And basically, if you haven't seen any of that, what I'm basically asking you is if you have any questions about Cambridge, whatever they may be, crazy, wacky, weird, 
try not to be too nasty okay but if you have any like questions i've really got quite a few questions i'm really excited but it's not just going to be me it's going to be myself and um some of my really good friends here as well that are going to be in the next vlog and answering all your questions so um yeah loads of people have just been asking me like people ask me oh what is it like in cambridge what's this like what's that like what's this like so i just thought let me just make a vlog about it but um yeah keep an eye out. and also you might see that <laughs> my hair <laughs> oh yeah my hair look at look at Look at, look at it. <laughs> oh yes, oh yes. Don't worry, I'm gonna talk about my hair in the vlog as well. So the vlog, the next vlog is gonna be like a mini hair review slash question and answer session. Um, yeah, it's not something that I'm gonna do often on my channel. I'm not a hair person. I'm not like, well, I love my hair and yeah, I love my hair, but I'm not like a hair person and a makeup person, whatever. I just try to look good and I just try to kind of look decent. So um, you won't see it as much, but this hair, <laughs> listen, it is quality. So I definitely think that I need to do a review and there's a couple of products I need to do a review on as well. So yeah, keep an eye out on um, the next vlog. But yeah, thank you so much for watching. Just take heed to what I'm saying, please know that you have a purpose fulfill it work hard to fulfill it and no matter who tries to put you down no matter what happens in life no matter what hardship you face keep jumping over those obstacles and do not be a i'll do it tomorrow type of fool are you stupid tomorrow might not come whether you be christian muslim um atheist whether you be black white pink asian whatever one thing that we can guarantee is that death we can't we don't know when that's gonna come death can come anytime it can knock on your door anytime so life is not guaranteed so just ensure that today you're ensuring that you're living your life and you're working hard and you're ensuring that your life can be the best that it could possibly be but yeah thank you so much for watching um, i'm gonna stop now but um yeah just keep an eye out subscribe and share and all of that jazz um and stay beautiful <laughs> Yeah, I found it, I found it, I found it. I had to put it in here. Layla Blogs. How can I say Lola? Jeez, what the hell is wrong with me? Layla Blogs. Listen, her story is inspirational. So yeah, I'm going to post the link to her YouTube channel below. Yeah, go and watch her YouTube channel. And if you want to lose weight, get up and go and lose some weight. Like, I'm even saying this to myself because there's a lot of things that I need to start doing as well. Like, I'm trying to exercise more and whatever. So I'm trying to go to the gym either every day or every other day. If I can do that, I'm the most laziest person in the world. You can do it too, but you just have to motivate yourself, boy. Layla Blogs. Go and do that. Don't eat that chocolate.